Hey guys, it's Kim with GK Geckos. Just going to give you a quick update on our eggs. We've got four in here in our incubator. I'll give you a look at them here. Sorry about that. Let me turn the light on. Okay. There's four of them. There they are. The first two were laid by cinnamon. And the second two, number ones were cinnamons. Number two was little bits. Little bit, that's her first um, clutch. I'm not sure about cinnamons. I think she's had them before. And at the earliest, cinnamon should be hatching possibly the 26th of July. So we're keeping an eye on them. But that's what eggs we have right now. Anxious to see what the babies are going to look like. Then, if I get done spinning you all around, We've done a lot of changing around in our gecko room here. We've still got our harem setups, harem one, with kids underneath them, harem two, there's Mac, we call him Mac Daddy. He's our Mac Snow Blizzard. Super Max No Blizzard. Uh, down here is our nestings, which we have actually five nesting right now, but only four down there. One of them's back in the uh, harem because she just does not do well on her own. But yeah, we've got five pregnant females right now. Number four set up where we're doing our mealworms ourselves and our beetles are under there over here that's our other pregnant female she's a super max snow she's in the middle of sleeping right now warming her tummy she's also shedding as you can tell but that's pretty she's the one that doesn't like to be alone so she's got company in there, believe it or not. You can't really see them much. There's one there in the log. But she just does not function well on her own. Our other changes. We've got a setup over here. We've got all of our food dishes and stuff like that. We brought out our two 10 gallons. There's nobody in that one down there in number 8. It's empty right now. But number seven, we've got Whitey still in there. He's not quite up to breeding age yet. We moved everything set up over here for storage, our books. And then we've got our other incubator set and ready to go. We finally got a power supply that'll work for it. More supplies there. And then Tangina and Sonny's down there and number five and then we got more storage so that's our latest updates um, we've got some various pictures of some of our kids here on the bulletin board I'll see if I can zoom in for you a little bit there's some of them there and then last but not least we've got Miss Wobbles who is no longer in this room she has graduated to a place of her own, so I'll take you with me, and I'll show you her condominium. Our watchdog's on break right now. She's out here in the living room. Aren't you, Shy Shy? Yeah. So, hi, everybody. <laughs> anyway, over here, Miss Wobbles, since we are not going to be breeding her, she's basically more so a pet. She actually has a background in this 20 gallon and she is 
over there in her moist hide sleeping. But she is our Max Snow Enigma that's got that neurological condition where she spins and goes in circles and falls over. She's the one I have to feed. But she's doing well and she's our baby. And sometime when she's awake, maybe our next video, I'll show you how she lays on her back and plays dead. So, well, that's it for our update, and we'll see you next time. Thanks, and God bless.